Hello guys, Zuljan here and welcome back to another episode of Savage Lands. I hope y'all are having an awesome day and thanks so much for the amazing support on this series. Guys, as always, if you do enjoy the videos, give me some tap on that like button to show you support. And you can subscribe to the channel for more daily videos. That's kind of trippy. I guess that's some Z fighting going on. So, I came down a little bit different way, guys. That's the river that we were crossing uh, to get to that mountain where we found the ice. The ice is going to be somewhere up over that direction, and the village that we came from, or my house, or where I've been living out of, is is actually passed that way. Uh, and this is the river that runs along the one that um, the one that we have the water that's that that we're facing. So there's a little bridge that connected here, and uh, there was actually a log that connected the two rock formations right there. But I wasn't brave enough to cross that, even though it didn't look like I could get up. From that side I'm out hunting iron and I don't recall this path um, I still haven't really been able to find my original um, house and spawn location and I think this may be where we're at I'm starting to get a little idea of what my surroundings are like and how to how to travel out and where to look but I still haven't pinpointed where I can find certain resources yet I do know you see, there's the dragon right there. I do know where we get iron now. Um, not iron. Um, coal. Uh, next to our house. And, um, I'm hoping that I can find the same for iron. I also found some copper. Uh, which is excellent. Like, a few nodes of copper. Okay, so I think that this was the original second village that we ran across. Meaning that if we continue along this path, what we'll find is the original spot. Uh, that we spawned and that wouldn't be terrible. It wouldn't be the the goal that we were after which is iron But it would be amazing to get back to our original spot because there was still that skeleton that we could have attacked and There's probably some resources that I would love getting a hold to all right. This is I Would love to get in here and get warm Just to refuel not not that I need to go anywhere or whatever. Okay. Let's go ahead and eat. Well, it's pro we're probably not that uh, we're probably not hungry enough to justify eating. Oh, that was that big giant thing over here. Okay. Uh huh. And it looks like there's a storm a brewing, uh, which isn't that good. Okay, so this wasn't the original village that I was at. It does pose an interesting deal though, because I would really like to know how this affects where we're at. I don't know if the, the storm is going to be a big deal, though. Like, I'm really, really tempted to to continue traveling. That's what I wanted to do, but I don't know if we shouldn't just stop here. Ouch. Ouch. All right. Anything? We should grab that. Um, you know what? I did find out that the rotting meat is good for a mushroom trap. Uh, so I need to collect a few of those. Okay, there's some ghouls here. It shouldn't be too tough to tell you the truth. I really don't think there's a whole bunch to explore within the town itself. Especially with that giant lurking around. I think that would be a bad idea. Honestly. Let's see. What about here? We've never really explored this place. What is this? Looks like some sort of... Portal? Oh, wow. Okay, so we need portal stones. You know, this may be like some in-game type stuff. We might get portal stones from the various bosses. I'm just speculating. I didn't look at any wikis or anything. I suppose you guys would probably let me know in the comments, although it's going to be a little while before I see them. I've been doing some, um, some pre-recording, some bulk recording, so that I can go to PAX and you guys will have videos while I'm going. So let me read what this says, if this thing will allow me to without kind of attacking me. I'm kind of scared, there's so many around. Let's check. Passenger, curse the scaled height. I can actually read this later, huh? Yeah, it sounds too crazy right here. Yep, I knew it. He was right on the side. As long as he doesn't disease me or anything, I think we'll be all right. Let's go ahead and steal it. All right. Yeah, I think it's probably better. Can we get warm in here? No, we can't. Not this one. I don't think it's really... I don't think we really ought to worry about getting warm one more time. 
this you know I might could go no that one's too broken down I was about to say it would be it would be good to get a little warm let's just I don't know man <laughs> I'm so torn whether to use my resources or not it's gonna be a long journey here so I do not want to um... all right I kind of know where to go now as far as when I get here this landmark I still haven't found, gosh, I really wish I knew which way to go from here. I don't want to go up here. I'd like to go here to look for iron, but we're so far away from home. I think it would be better just to keep exploring and see if I can find it. Let's go ahead and do that. I'm going to go as far as I can here. Let's follow the beach again. Yeah, I'm not going to go up and explore that mountain. We already know that iron. I think that iron is on the same mountain as we found the ice. Um, but where we stopped where the ice was, I just don't think that was far enough. So I do know that if we go over the coast here until we hit this rock, we're going to need to go left into that town, then past the town and to the right in order to get home. All right. As far as this guy here, they disease, which limits my stamina. And I do not want to do that. I should eat too. Now it's probably time to eat. So my stamina can refill. If for some reason one of these things hit me and diseases me, um, my stamina will be, the cap will be full. That way if I do have to run for anything, um, the meter will be longer than if I wouldn't have done it at all. Okay, so this is still along the beach. I'm going to try to navigate using landmarks and just, you know, common sense. Which is, navigation for me, y'all, is a big, a big, very, very hard deal. Alright, this, this one looks like a different color. Ooh, spores. Yeah, that one's like frost or whatever. Oh my god, he hit hard too. Okay, hold on. Nothing to fear. Nothing to fear. Actually, we should probably use two. Alright, what can I get from this guy? Bear pelts he gives. And raw goat meat and stones. Nothing major. Alright. Uh, okay, we were headed down along this path. Not bad. You know, I could make a lean to right here. This is probably a good middle of the road deal here. I'll tell you what, let's do that. Let's make a lean-to. Is there relatively easy to make? Can I place it? Yes. Okay, and we probably have most of the stuff already. I need a few sticks, which isn't going to be a problem at all. In fact, I should be able to get some just like this. Wood sticks. Beautiful. Alright, lean to is made, so my cold will eventually go down here. It doesn't happen too fast, but it's better than nothing. And being that it's night and I think the temperature goes down a little bit colder, it's probably best that I do that here. I uh, should check to see. My hammer is in good repair. My sword. I'm going to need to get a little bit of... Um, I'm going to need to get a little bit of whetstone soon. I already have two, which should be good for uh, a sword repair, I think. And that's going to be alright. Uh, being that the sword has such a high durability, it doesn't really go down often. As long as I don't use it as a primary cutting tool, I think I'll be okay. The only thing that I should be cutting here is, is aminals. <laughs> alright. Um... I'm going to go ahead and use a, uh, well, let me get a little bit warmer, then I'll use my uh, my bandages, and we should be good. As far as my hunger goes, I'm going to conserve this last piece of meat. It should be alright. We should build a few more of these lean-tos in areas that we go toward uh, more often. That way we'll have some place to, uh, to kind of park once we get to a destination. So let's just say this was an area that we would be mining at. It would be good because we can go in, mine, come back, warm up before the tr the trek back home, you know? All right, let's go ahead and use bandages. 
Alright, and that should be pretty good here. Alright, we're gonna continue on. I could get a few berries here, but I don't think it's worth it. When I run out of food, I can always look for berries. It's not gonna be bad. And if we're actually going the right way, it'll be great. Okay, um... What sort of rock is this? If it's just flint, I'm bailing. It's not flint. It is tin. We do need tin. Being that we're on this side now, we're back where the tin spawns, we're gonna need some because it's still better than, uh, bronze is still very, very much better than what our current equipment is. And besides coal, you do need tin. I mean, besides uh, copper, you do need tin. And we have plenty of copper to mix with that, so it'll be good. Alright, let's go back, shall we? Get back on the road again. Let's take a look at all of our surroundings here. I'm going to see if I'm not missing any nodes. Doesn't look like it. Not that I'm confident that we would find iron here. In fact, I'm pretty sure we won't find iron here. Okay, there's another one of those frost guys. I really wish there was a way around him without attacking him. I don't think it's going to happen. Though. We could just run past him. You know what? Let's do that. Let's do that. Let's just not chance the fight. I really think I could lose him. And being that we're just on the path right here, it's better that we take him away from our lean-to anyway. That way, if he doesn't despawn or whatever, we'll know... Um, that will be safe if we fight him and get to our lean to again. Alright. Okay. Is he still behind us? Nope. Oh man, I saw the smoke and I thought <laughs> I thought for a second there that that was the dragon. Alright. Where are we all? Where are we? I don't know whether it's to continue to follow the road. I guess that's really my only option. It's not my only option. I just I could just keep following the coast. Honestly, I think that's the smarter bit. I'm gonna veer off a path. Yeah, it does look like the 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 road path is a little bit more dangerous. At least that's what I'm seeing locally here. Let's see, three monsters that I've already seen off the beach, or zero on the beach. Yeah, it's pretty clear that the uh, the beach path wins here. We are so far away from home right now. If we were to die, we would have to almost fully re-equip to get back. Alright. Well, not fully re-equip, but there goes the torch. That scares me every time it happens. We need to get a little bit further out before we try to make another one. Yeah, because this guy is definitely following us. Definitely following us. He, he, he'll give up chase after a little while, though. They usually do. Alright. Yep, he gave up chase, just like we thought. Alright, let's see if I can make another damn torch really quickly. I did. Good. Alright. It, it pays keeping some of those basic supplies. Okay, we're back in bear country. Which is kind of unsettling. That means that we aren't close to home. Or the original home. What if we made just a big old loop-de-loop? -loop? If we did... That's not going to be terrible. Because at least I have a little... There's no way though. I mean, we crossed the river and all kind of stuff. I really don't think so. I think this is just another area. It does give us some idea on what's out here though. We found that portal with the... Uh, with like the stones and stuff so I suppose that's how to get off the island <laughs> I don't know maybe it brings us to another area that that I'm not familiar with this game might be a whole lot bigger than I thought because honestly with the island and the way it is the content is pretty solid like I'm having a good time with the game I'm not reading too much information on it or watching other people's videos on it because like it gives me it's more of a sense of accomplishment when I figure uh, out stuff. I do read a little bit to try to find out what's up when I'm totally stuck or when I don't know something, you know? Because I don't want to just, like, fumble through episodes on basic stuff. Even though I guess survival is basic in itself. But, I don't know, some of it's entertaining. Like, when I'm hunting for stuff, at least I'm entertained. And I feel like it's an engaging video, whether or not 
I actually find stuff like iron hunting can't be the title of this episode because well iron hunting I suppose it could uh, iron hunting fail would be more accurate <laughs> but oh well all right there is a little bit of mountain here we could see if there's any nodes there's one of those tatas right there I don't see any nodes that close Let's see, I may be able to get past them without aggravating them. Yeah, I suppose so. Alright. Is anything back here? No, it's just some it's just a rock formation. I can't wait for day, man. I can't wait until daytime. Okay, there's a house, finally. Some sort of civilization. Not that it's anything is civilized there. But oh, there's a bear in our way. Alright. Make sure I could I should go ahead and eat now. Alright, I'm gonna try to go around to the left here. The Northlands sound familiar. I need to pay more attention to like would the words say above my chat? Because that will tell me like what what region I'm in, so to speak. And I don't know if this is a good place or a bad place or what. Actually, to tell you the truth, this spot kind of reminds me of where we came from. But it seems like I've just been traveling in one direction for so long. Okay, we've been here before because there's a lean-to. Did we make this? No, there's no way. We may have. You know what? I might as well dump some resources into it. We would need five more sticks. I think we can do that really quickly. Wood stick. Alright, we still need two to make this happen. We could get that no problem. Let's, um, tell you what. We already left our food down here. Let's just pull the axe out and do, do some logs really quick. Chopped it on its way down, man. Alright, we got logs. Good. Oh! I think... I made a friend. Ouch. Get away. Get away from me. Alright, he's dead. He's dead. We got some more amber. That's good. I don't know. I'm not gonna take the tree nuts. I have no idea what. Well, maybe we can eat those, huh? You know, I never tried. I suppose we should try to eat them. Yeah, they give 20 health and um, 2.5 health and some hunger. Well, that's that's cool. I don't know why I uh, ah that thing doesn't. That's bad. That's bad. That's bad. That's bad. That's bad. All right, I tell you what. Oh my God, are you serious right now? We just gotta go, y'all. I didn't even turn him to um to sticks yet. This is this is gonna be bad. Potentially very, very bad. I don't think these things give chase easy. I need to juke him. Oh my god! I need to juke him on something. What can I juke him on? I might need to just turn around and fight. But there's two of them, man. Oh my gosh. Whew. Can they follow me through this stuff? Gah! Gah! Hit me in the back. And we are so far away from our stuff. Oh my gosh. Oh. <laughs> Dang. Alright. Let's see. What? <laughs> no, we aren't. We're actually right there. You mean to tell me we went all that way? Oh my gosh. Well, <laughs> that's about right. We did make a big loop. I have no idea how, but I'm really glad we did because 
here we can just go get our stuff, man. We can just go get our stuff right here. There's probably going to be the spawns around, but we might be able to juke them and bring them back. Oh my gosh. All right. Can you believe it? A little bit further, and we could have actually found that we were, um, we were going the wrong way the whole time. Wow. Hmm. Unbelievable. All right. Well, we're almost there, and I should make sure that my stamina gets back. And I'll be able to get my stuff. Hopefully, those things are still not around my stuff. We'll be able to test spawn mechanics this time, I guess. All right. Let's see. Let's get to our stuff. I still can't believe we died, man. Going that far. At least I got some stuff to show for it. Like, we got some tin, which we hadn't had a whole lot of before. We found those portals. That was interesting. Normally, an episode like this, I would probably just not show. But I think it's important that we do. I think it's important that you guys see me fail sometimes, you know? Okay. Uh, no, we don't want to do that. We just want to move. Just want to move everything over. I hope nothing's trying to kill me here. Alright, I think I'm going to be alright. Yep. Perfect. Alright. I can't believe, man. We did it. We really did do it. We got our stuff back. We made a big old circle and we explored. There was the bear that originally killed me, probably. No, I'm pretty sure it despawned. I don't know how the spawn mechanics works or whatever, but the good news is that the uh, we went to um, get our stuff back and the, the same creatures that killed us weren't there anymore. So, well. That was a whole lot of death, but at least we made it. As far as, and speaking of making it, am I going the right way again? Yes, I am. Kind of worried for a minute there. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, so we do know that this island, maybe I should have never crossed at that section that I could have crossed. I don't know. I'm going to explore a little bit, but I think that we're going to try to go of that mountain again and try to find some iron where we found the ice last time so i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did give me some dap on that like button to show you support and you can subscribe to the channel for more daily videos guys thanks for so much for watching as always this is Ulgen signing off and we'll see you next time